Hi everyone, just a short video here to uh, check in on my newly named Ben Hoover. Uh, this is, I'm calling this Ben Hoover because we are checking out uh, vacuum cleaner dust from our canister vacuum uh, to see whether the worms got into it. I've done one check-in already and the worms were really into it. So this is my next look. I've been um, out of commission for a few days. So I haven't been checking in on this probably for four days or so, maybe five. So let's check and see what the worms are doing. So under the bubble wrap here, I can see there's still good moisture, which is good because I was worried about these bins drying out when I wasn't able to check in them on a regular basis. Sorry about the lighting here. You can tell that the getting lots of shadow coming and going. Oh, is that a worm in there? Nope, nope, that's just writing on the grocery bag. Okay, so the vacuum um, canister test sample is over in this corner. So you move my hand a bit closer with the camera. So this is where, oh, it's a bit crunchy here at the side. So it did dry out a bit there. This is where the vacuum material is under this, under this area. So I do see worms in that area. There's worms uh, in the cardboard that's on top of the vacuum canister. Let me peel that back. There's definitely tucking their tails in. There's definitely worms. There's definitely worms. I know you're in the light. There you go. Definitely worms in on the corrugated cardboard. Okay, I should be down to the vacuum material now. I'll just scoop wide enough so I get I can see the dust there. There's another there's another red wiggler just hanging out. I do believe it's not very um it's not very full this bin because I this my was my aging bedding bin and uh and I used some of it. So there they are in the vacuum canister material. So obviously there's castings now being deposited in the vacuum dust. So I'll peel back the layers of the vacuum dust. You can see worms in, you know, the vacuum dust looks a lot like our pet hair because we've got a golden lab. So it's gold hair, which we have fed. Oh, and look at that chubby red wiggler feeding on the, um, feeding on the dust coming out of a vacuum cleaner. That is a chubby one. Um, so if that's any indication that they like this, my goodness, and they are in it. They, they are not just hanging out on the outside. I was worried that it would be a little bit too dry for them. Um, I've really only uh, had the moisture from the surrounding area. So, but look at, here's another big clump of it. Oh, and there's an apple that I put in the bin for moisture. Um, but you know, there's the apple. Yes, it's got worms on it and in it, but look at this vacuum material and you can tell just from the amount of castings that is deposited on it, in it, through it, that they are absolutely munching this up. Can you imagine the bacteria? Oh, that isn't an apple. Sorry. That's an inside of an avocado pit. Sorry. Can you imagine how much bacteria is in a vacuum? And these guys are just eating it up. Uh, so delighted. And look at their little tails. They're stuck right out of the material. Head, heads first, these little guys. Heads first, right into, the, right into the vacuum dust. So what we're gonna do now is I'm gonna stop filming this shaky video. My husband's insisting on keeping the rest of the container of vacuum material uh, in a garbage bag outside because it is so dusty. And so we are going to shut the camera off and I'm gonna fluff the rest of this bin first, um, but we're gonna shut the camera off. And so what I'm now going to do is I am going to put more vacuum uh, material in here and uh, and this, 
so oh and look at this is interesting this is just dog hair and it does not have the same number of worms as the vacuum dust has um not you know they might have disappeared out of it oh no there is one worm in there uh but yeah this isn't vacuum dust this is actually from the dog brush so anyway uh we're now going to put more vacuum dust in there and uh and then i'll bring you back and we will uh, mix it up all right see you soon